what's going on my name is Joe and this is going to be my first sort of tutorial video on this channel and this is something I've had requested to me quite a few times now and it's going to be how to paint items in Source Filmmaker so this is the best way I've found to do it so let's just assume you've got your uh, person you want to add an item to and paint it first thing you want to do is obviously remove the helmet so you go set body groups helmet and none so that removes the hat completely and the best way I've found to add items quickly as well would be to do this so let's just say I want the ground control, so we'll just simply search ground control, click it and it automatically adds it to the soldier. So what you're going to want to do is right click the hat you want to paint and add override materials, then you're going to want to right click it again, go to show in element viewer and press model. So once you're over here you're going to want to scroll to the bottom and press materials and then once you're there press materials for the second option down and you will see two colours here. You're going to click the bottom one and this is where you can choose essentially any colour you want. So let's just say I want it to have gold paint. So we'll find yellow on the graph and just click over here. And as you can see, the colour of the hair is changing. So this is essentially, you can make it any colour you want, um, obviously within reason. So this isn't necessarily how to make it into TF2 paint, this is just how to change your colour. But it essentially looks like it's got TF2 paint on anyway. So let's just say I wanted lime paint, we'd go over to the green and that sort of does look like lime to me. So um, yeah, that's just about it guys this is the best way and the most quick way i've found to paint items in source filmmaker so i hope you did enjoy if you did please do remember to leave a like and if this did help let me know in the comments below thanks for watching guys and peace that is the first way to do it but i didn't actually mention there is indeed two ways to do it so um the second way you do it is let's just say we've got a scout so i'm going to quickly add a scout now and there's yes yeah, so the, the first way of doing it is of course doing it manually and the second way of doing it is using a rig from the steam workshop if you don't know what the steam workshop is um it's essentially a place where people can submit their own sort of content and uh people can just download it and use it in whatever the game or the program's for so let's just quickly remove the uh hat from the scout and we'll quickly add uh, the troublemakers tossle cap oh i forgot with the scout you need to remove the headphones as well so now we've done that we'll just go over to add team fortress items and trouble yep there it came up so let's just say we want to make it lime you're going to come over to the steam workshop for source filmmaker and just simply search paint and the one you are looking for should of course be one it's this one docs color script so you're going to come over to this and to download it and use it in SFM you're just going to want to press subscribe. So once you press subscribe SFM will ask you if you want to sort of use it and you're just going to agree. So once you're back in SFM you're going to want to right click on the hat you want to paint and just simply hover over rig and you will now see set up model colouring uh, something whatever, whatever that says it's not really important but you want to click it and you will see this uh, colour here and once you dr click the drop down menu there will be a list of all the different paints you can use so let's just say pink of hell done of course it paints as pink as hell so it's a really quick way of doing things it's just of course not manual so uh yes yeah, that's probably the fastest and most efficient way of doing it you can see all the paints are here in tf2 uh let's just say australian gold for example boom it's painted gold so that's probably the quickest way of doing it but i just prefer doing it the other way personally because it's more manual and you get to pick any variety of color but that's just me i mean it's up to you at the end of the day but that's just about it guys uh, thank you for watching and peace. Won't put food on the table. Now they all attacking them, cause I'm passionate. Nissan gotta take it to the maxima. Told them I was up next and they laughed at them. So I didn't say shit, I just backed it up.